welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Today I'm here with my lovely assistant, my sister Sarah. She's here today to help me with some hair tutorials. So this is what we created for you today. I'm going to turn around so you can see. It's a really, really easy, simple French braid. Again, we didn't go too tight or too loose, so this is just a simple one that you can do for every day. I hope that you do like this look and that you keep watching. That way you can see how you can do it yourself as well. get right into the tutorial so starting off you want to comb through all the hair make sure there's no knots as creating a braid sometimes does create knots so you do want to make sure that you have a nice comb through hair no knots whatsoever okay so we're just taking part of the hair i'm taking the front part right now and i'm just creating a split all across the hairline making sure that there are no hairs in the sides as we'll be grabbing extra hair as we go along so now taking my fingers I'm just running them across the hair and making sure that I have three even parts and with this is what we're gonna start the braid taking the side parts and I'm putting it over the middle part I'm then doing the same with the left side I'm taking the left side and putting it over the middle part then I'm going to continue on again, taking the right side over the middle strand, the left side of the hair, and putting that strand over the middle strand of the hair. Going on, I'm grabbing pieces of hair from the right side and attaching that and adding that hair to the piece that was on the side and crossing that over. I'm then doing the same with the left side of the hair. So I'm adding more hair to the left side and crossing that over the middle strand as well. You'll see that now it's created somewhat of a braid. So you're gonna just continue this process all the way down. I'm going to grab some hair from the left side, add it to the strand on the left side and cross it over the middle side. I'm going to take some hair from the right side, add it to the strand that's on the right side and cross that over the middle strand of hair. Continue this process all the way down and you'll see the French braid is coming together. reach further down onto the hair you want to continue on with the same exact process nothing changes because it's further down it's the same thing to do this process remember that you can grab smaller pieces of hair to make it a lot thinner and a really clean and crisp braid or you can grab even bigger strands so it's all personal preference you can always make it tighter or looser depending on your preference as well if you do want to poof it up at the end you can definitely do that as well So as you see here, I'm getting to the end of the hair and I have grabbed the last strand. When you've gotten to the end of the hair, just complete a regular braid and then my lovely assistant will hand me over a little hair tie. This is a clear hair tie. Again, you can use any color you like. You can make it fun for kids as well and add colors. But in my case, I'm just using a clear hair tie. If you did want to also take the ends of it and kind of create a bun or tuck it in underneath, you can do that as well. This is a pretty simple standard braid. If you would like to see a different one that's maybe a little tighter or looser or one that's poofed up and made more, um, kind of more elaborate, please do let me know in the comments below and I'll be happy to create that tutorial as well. Thumbs up, subscribe below, and remember to always create a life that you love.